morning, everyone. Um, today's lesson is a two-parter. It's module six, lesson six, and it's on page 43. It says, Adam built a toy box for his children's wooden block. If the inside dimensions of the box are 18 inches by 12 inches by six inches, what are the maximum number of two-inch wooden blocks that will fit in the box? So we're just focusing on part A right now. Please pause, circle your clue words, and then unpause. Adam built a toy box for his children's wooden blocks. If the inside dimensions, now we know dimensions mean our measurements, of the box are 18 inches by 12 inches by two in, or by six inches, what are the maximum number of two inch wooden cubes that will fit in the box? So we actually did one very similar to this last week. So we know that we're not really trying to find out the volume of the box itself, but we're trying to figure out how many, how many two inch cubes can fit inside our box. So I'm gonna draw a picture of the box to help us get started. So it says 18 inches. I'm gonna label that 18 inches by 12 inches, okay? There's my box. By last measurement, six inches. All right, so here's my box. 12 inches by 18 inches by six inches. Now, remember what we're trying to figure out is how many two inch blocks can fill up this box. So if I'm thinking about each row and I have 18 inches, and each block is two inches, that's two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18 is how many blocks? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 18 divided by two is nine cubes. We can draw it or just do our math. So 18 divided by two is nine. 12 divided by two is six. Cubes would go here. And six divided by two, three cubes would go here. So then all we have to do to find out how many total cubes would fit in here is multiply our cubes together. So nine times three, 27. 27 times six, six times seven is 42. Six times two is 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 162, please pause and write your sentence. So, 162 cubes will fit in the toy box. Cool. All right. Um, in a second, we're going to start with part B. So, get yourself prepared for part B. All right, welcome back for part B. For this one, we're going to have to do something similar. So let's read through it and follow our same process as always. Adam built a toy box for his children's wooden blocks. So same start. We have our wooden toy box. What if he built the box 16 inches by 9 inches by 9 inches? What is the maximum number of 2-inch wooden cubes that would fit? Please pause and circle your clue words. So it says, what if Adam built the box 16 inches by nine inches by nine inches? What is the maximum? Maximum, maximum means largest or biggest. Number of two inch, we're still working with those two inch wooden cubes. That would fit. So. It kind of sounds like the exact same question, so let's get started trying to solve it. And if you would like to pause and try to solve it on your own, please go ahead. So I'm gonna draw my box just like I did last time. Do 16 inches by nine inches. Dot. 
Did my best. Fine. Nine inches. Okay. So if we're using the same strategy, I'm gonna going to kind of think about it the same way. So let's look at this 16. And our blocks are two inch wood blocks again. So two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 14, 16. So how many blocks is that? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 blocks because 16 divided by 2 is 8. So last time we just took that formula and applied it to the other measurements, right? Now we have a huge problem this time. Our problem is that this is an odd number. So if we split it in half, we'll get a decimal or a fraction. Now am I cutting the children's blocks into pieces? No. So you need to kind of think about it. it. How many blocks would actually fit here without like using a half? Because we, we don't have half blocks. We just have these two inch cubes. So if I did that, I'd go two, four, six, eight. There's going to be a little bit of space up here, but I don't have enough room to put in an extra block where it would stick out the top. So I can only fit four, I should say eight cubes. I can only fit, unfortunately, four cubes here. That is the maximum number that would fit without going over the top. So same thing, if I'm doing nine again, it's obviously going to be only four that fit. So four cubes here, and there'd be a little bit of space left over. Let's pretend there's a little space somewhere over there. Four cubes. So again, just like last time, now how I solve this problem, is to just simply multiply my numbers of cubes. So eight times four equals 32. 32 times four. Four times two is eight. Four times three is 12. Please go ahead and write your sentence. The maximum number of cubes that will fit is 128 cubes. 